Vu. What's going on there, YouTube? Thank you again for tuning in to my channel, Project Flip. As you can tell, we're on the test drive now, so welcome to uh, part two here. I'll just call it the test drive. That way you can guys get a little bit better of the uh, the audio here. Um, I also did get a better window mount here, so that way it's a little bit better. It's a it's a Joby window mount with a quarter inch screw. Um, I'll put a link down in the description here for you, so that way if you guys want to take a look at it, you can. Uh, but right now we're just kind of sitting in traffic I'm gonna see if we can try to jump on the freeway here for you guys so that way you can get a little bit better uh, sound out of it uh, that way you can really hear what this thing does I'm, I'm not gonna lie to you this thing is loud it goes undercover but this thing is ridiculously loud when it's opened up I mean it's not bad at the lower RPMs but this thing is loud, guys, so just be warned. So let's go ahead and hop on the freeway. All right, so people want to let me on the freeway to be able to show you, so we're going to hit a little stretch here. Right now, I'm just under 3,000 RPM, doing like 50 miles an hour. I was fourth gear, now I'm in fifth. And sorry if it's a little shaky. Hopefully the, uh, the it's stabilizing enough here. But I'm still trying to find a way to get on the freeway here. That way I can open it up. Now, it's not bad, you know, as long as you, you drive it normally. It, it's not bad, you know what I mean? See if I can get on the freeway over here. They're gonna turn. Yeah, make a turn. If you don't like the loud droney noise, I would highly recommend getting like a uh, a glass pack to replace your resonator that it comes with with this uh, exhaust kit. We're about to get on the freeway, y'all, so I'm gonna open it up a little bit for you. It definitely gives it more power, I can tell you that. And the rest of the exhaust combined all together it's definitely worth it in my opinion as far as a cheap kit the noise that it comes with I, I'm not a fan of as you, as you can tell it is very loud but overall performance wise I am I am impressed I am impressed it, it definitely gives it a nice little import, uh, improved import, uh, blah, blah, blah. it gives it a nice improved performance and you feel it you could definitely feel it pulling through the RPMs and it will pull you through the RPMs um, I will recommend getting a glass pack um, to be able to replace your resonator to be able to dampen the sound um, you do have Unless you're gonna, you know, cut the flanges off and the hangers off, you you are limited in space. So make sure you measure the diameter and the length 
to make sure you have the proper spacing in there. I measured mine and I have about 25 inches in length from the hanger to the flange and I'm not going to cut the flange and make it a straight pipe in case I need to remove the system. Um, so, you know, from the hanger to the, to the flange, it is about 25 inches and so I'm working with, you know, cut and weld about, I would say safely, you know, about 22 inches. Um, so anything within that range you can get, it is about two and a half inch piping. Uh, so you can go, you can get away with two and a quarter inch, no, no more than two and a half inch. Uh, but definitely I'm going to be looking into that as well. I'll keep you guys updated once I actually move forward with it. Until then I will have to keep it muffled. Uh, you know, just kind of drive it, you know, normally, like a human. I only did this for you guys so you can get a, a better sound test. You know, it's still kind of, kind of drowning, kind of loud as you kind of get on the gas a little bit, but if you drive it normal, it's not bad. Keep it within the speed limit and it's, it's tolerable. But, uh, just wanted to kind of give you guys a part two. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did enjoy this video, please give me a thumbs up. If you want to see more updates about this build, it's my 2001 Ford Focus ZX3 hatchback. You know, consider subscribing to my channel. I would really appreciate it. I'll put links in the description uh, for the headers and the exhaust if you want to take a look at that as well. I'll also put links to the equipment that I use if you want to take a look at that as well if you want to get into vlogging or anything like that. Uh, but thanks again, guys, for tuning in, and I'll catch you guys later. Peace.